Hello and welcome to the Outpost RV. My name is Jeremy and today we're going to take a look at the Wolf Pup 16 FQ. This camper comes in at 21 feet, 10 inches, tongue to bumper, and comes, comes in right at 3,200 pounds empty. As we get started up front here, we have your tongue jack. It is the manual tongue jack that you can flip this handle over and you'll use a cordless screw gun to run this up and down. We have a 20 pound LP tank bottle that will be filled by the Outpost RV. We have the juice pack option on the camper, which means we have some solar up on the roof as well as your Group 27 Deep Cycle Marine battery. Diamond plate rock guard, we have the curved radius front end. Moving to the side, we have your front storage compartment with the built-in LED light. We have four manual jacks on the camper, two in the front and two in the back. Down below, you're gonna notice this extra light that they've added. We have the wolf head emblem here. This holographic light at nighttime really pops and uh, looks great at the campgrounds. We have your power awning where each arm is adjustable. So if you're, the sun's coming down, you can adjust the pitch of the awning here. We have the blue LED accent light as well. All of our windows have the reflective tint on it. We have your deep tinted black tempered glass entrance door. It does have an integrated window and a full size screen door as well. Oversized grab handle. We have your sturdy steps for the entrance where each leg is adjustable. So if you're on different levels of ground, Outside speakers that light up blue. We also have a TV bracket here, so that way your TV on the inside, you can just lift it up, bring it out here, drop it in and watch TV on the outside. You'll notice the center cap is popped off. These are the quick easy loop axles and it also has self adjusting brakes. We have a tire pressure monitoring system. How that'll work, the side of it will turn red if you're low on air. So we'll unscrew that to demonstrate. And that way you can just walk around and do a visual check. Uh, to make sure you're good on air before you head off to your next destination. We have your TV connections here. We have your pup kitchen with the mini fridge and your prep space. We are pet friendly. We have your leash latch here. That way the furry family members can tag along. We have your spare tire with the cover in the back. Up top, the backup camera comes with it, as well as a bracket for a roof ladder. Over here on the side, we have this off-door porch light, so that way you can see at nighttime if you're gonna be dumping or hooking up over here. We have your dump station right down below, black handle for the black tank, gray handle for the gray tank. This is a 30 amp unit. It comes with a 25 foot detachable power cord. We have your furnace vent, outside shower with hot and cold water. And actually right underneath that is gonna be the water fill station. We have your city water on the right. So that way, if you're at a campground, you hook the water hose up here and that'll pressurize your lines. We have the fresh water connection over here. So if you're dry camping or boondocking, you fill up your fresh water tank, turn on the water pump and use that water. Last but not least, we have your on-demand water heater. It is on-demand, so it's gas only, but about 60% more efficient than what we've used in the past. So it's only using gas when you're running hot water. And that concludes our outside walkthrough of the Wolf Pup 16 FQ. Now we'll take a look at the inside. As we move to the inside, you'll notice they have another light shining down with the Wolf Pup emblem there. In the 16 FQ, you get this Murphy bed up front with extra closet storage as well. We have your kitchen right across, bathroom in the back, and your dinette over here. And we'll get started on this side. We have your dinette with storage underneath each seat that can also go down to make another sleeping area. We have a huge picture window there. 110 and 12 volt charge port on the wall. Up top, you have extra storage up there. We have your furnace thermostat in the top left. Stereo, which is AM, FM and Bluetooth compatible. Then we have your main control panel where you can turn your lights, um, I'm sorry, your awning lights on and off. And also your water pump run your awning in and out and see how full and empty the tanks are. That is also Bluetooth, so you can sync your phone to it and run some of the options that way as well. Up on the ceiling, we have your speaker and subwoofer. Those light up blue and your TV bracket on the back wall there with the connections on the ceiling. As we head back into the bathroom, this has a huge bathroom in it. It goes wall to wall. We have your toilet right inside. Right up above that, we have your vent fan. And then we have the shower over here to the right. 
And we'll step in here and take a look at the entire shower. You have your built-in shelves over there. Shower head up top. And we'll take a look at the bottom. Nice rectangle shower pan here. Good size. It's a very functional bathroom where you have room to walk in here. Down below the lavatory, we have storage down here. A huge counter space, large single bowl sink, 110 outlet. And then right over here, we're gonna have your medicine cabinet. So extra storage there. Moving over to the side, we have your thermostat. That is for your water heater. So you'll turn it on and off there and also adjust the temperature of your water. Moving on out, we have your 12 volt refrigerator. It is 12 volt only, which is why we have the solar up top. It is uh, more of a residential size. It doesn't need the same ventilation like the gas electrics do, so it's very deep. You get a lot of extra storage. With the red key, we have your 12 volt cutoff switch. Above that, a carbon monoxide detector, and then your breakers and fuses. And now we will step out and take a look at the kitchen area here. The kitchen is gonna come equipped with a two burner stove and that has the glass cover over it so you could use that as prep space if you're not cooking. Underneath that is gonna be your furnace. We have storage under the sink. Large counter space here with the high rise faucet. Um, the sink also comes with a prep cover so you can utilize that if you're not using the sink. And as you can see, that is a huge stainless steel bowl large window in the kitchen as well the full length there we have your range vent and microwave and more storage up top we have your voltmeter off to the right so you can keep an eye on your battery up in the bedroom we have your murphy bed we have windows on both sides of the bedroom 110 and 12 volt charge ports on both sides as well and then, of course, you have hanging storage on the sides and storage up above. And I'm going to go ahead and pause the video real quick to show you what the Murphy bed looks like when it's folded out. And here is a view of the bed with it folded down out all the way. As you can see, the couch lays flat and the mattress folds right on top of it. And that will conclude our walkthrough of the Wolf Pup 16FQ. I appreciate you guys watching. If you have any questions, feel free to contact myself or Henry at 866-338-9845. Thank you guys for watching and have a great day.